Hi, I'm Benny for Recycling Me. I, uh, I'm glad to meet you with an, another market update uh, today. I hope you're doing good. Um, now let me go into the topic now. Uh, really the COVID-19 pandemic has sparked numerous uh, questions and uncertainty in the market around the globe. We have been updating how the current we have been updating the current market movement and how the metal market, the commodity market is affected uh, due to this uh, outbreak. Major market players uh, who stayed out of the uh, business, out of the import market, have resumed their purchase uh, amid recovering demand from uh, country's uh, local uh, steel, uh, local long steel market. Uh, however, the market is very quiet in the mid May, uh, mid of May, uh, due to this Eid uh, festival. Moreover, container freight rates uh, and uh, Eid bank closure uh, would, uh, would worry make worry to the steel scrap traders. It is hard to see that traders who are doing uh, container uh, steel scrap import uh, are battling expensive with this uh, expensive freight rate. Market contributors ex express that uh, container freight rates for steel scrap have continued to increase in the recent months due to factors such as renewed tightness of container following bottlenecks at port. Uh, together with the shipping lines are looking to uh, recoup uh, some of their lost earnings. Uh, we can see around 6% increase uh, in price uh, to uh, $1.255 per metric ton for HMS 1 and 2 uh, to India from Europe region comparing to the previous month. Following the COVID-19 EC uh, in India, Turkey and Vietnam and some other countries, we can see some demand in the global market. Vietnam especially, uh, import scrap price have performed strongly over the seven days amid a combined, uh, rec um, combined uh, combination of high demand from Southeast Asia countries. South Vietnam buyers have booked Japanese H2 scrap at $2.255 per metric ton CFR Vietnam. Turkey mill books more cargoes from USA, Baltic region and Europe region. H2 is 1 and 2, uh, 90 uh, is to 10 were sold at USD 259 per metric ton from USA uh, recently. Concerning UK, UK market edges higher amid reduced scrap generation. UK market witnessed steady trade from Europe into their key destinations such as Turkey and the Indian subcontinent. Uh, concerning India, uh, market rises at uh, uh, increased uh, interest growth. We can see for further improvement, uh, we can also see further improvement as many of the steel makers uh, resumed their operations at different locations. We can see, the, uh, we, have, we can also see the buying price for HMS uh, uh, increased around 9% percentage in South Tamil Nadu. Concerning Japan, Japanese Tokyo Steel announced a price hit in its scrap purchase for the first time since mid uh, since uh, since uh, mid of uh, December 2019 and China's uh, Shanka Jiangku Steel Group kept its domestic scrap procurement price unchanged. Pakistan steel industry absorbed a, a slight hike. Buyers have started booking uh, for their late June shipment. And concerning Bangladesh, Bangladesh imported offers improves on a weekly basis. South Korea, we can see uh, yet another price kick this week. Uh, rising, uh, 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 rise, sorry. We can see a price rising by a JYP 1000 per metric ton for Japanese H2 scrap against the uh, last week closing. Eventually, we can see a positive note on uh, import scrap with a strong uh, demand and uh, improved sentiment. Uh, let's see how the market is going in, in the coming days. I will keep you updated with an another report the other days. Sure. Thank you.